Hey, here's a technique I've kind of developed uh, when dealing with uh, stranded or solid, for that matter, uh, wire when I'm doing into these things that you twist to bind the, the wire. So I'll go in, you know, get it, uh, you know, get it pretty tight so it kind of squeaks a little bit. Then I go wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. It's kind of you move it around a little bit, and then I notice that it it, uh, it turned a little bit more. And um, this one's already been uh, done, so it really won't do it. But if you're doing like a freshly stripped wire, and you stick it in there, and crank it down, you know, fairly tight. You know, you don't want to bust it off the circuit board, of course, but uh, just, you know, just crank it down and then uh, wiggle it, you know, left and right, up and down, you know, with, again, without busting the board. And then, um, and you'll be surprised how much extra you can turn that screw. And you do that several times until it doesn't change much anymore. And then that should be a pretty secure uh, connection. Um, and I've seen it, you know, it's like, you know, you do it, it's tight. And, you, and then like a year later, all of a sudden you're, you know, you're wondering why you're not getting any power in your house. And I went up on the roof on this one house that I did before I did this technique and, this, and the damn wire had, you know, come loose. And, uh, and it got really hot, you know, it was melting the plastic and stuff. So it can be a potentially dangerous thing. So, you know, stick it in, tighten it, wiggle, 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 tighten, wiggle, wiggle, tighten, wiggle, wiggle, tighten. And then uh, that should be enough to, to, uh, make it last a long time.